What is going on? Outlaws Bet here. And today I want to break down the hot news going around right now about the possible new ability cards coming to Red Dead Online. So let's talk about it. First off, a big shout out to Test Funds, who is the founder or the one that discovered these news. I will post a link to his Twitter down below so you can check him out. With that being said, there are four new ability cards that were found, two of which have names. So let's talk about it. The first ability card we have is a healing ability card. I do like my healing ability cards because they're very useful in PvE scenarios and even though for the meta or the PvP aspect of the game, ain't nobody got time for healing ability cards, I think it's a nice new addition to the game even though like I said it won't have a big impact on the meta. Now the next ability cards I'm going to be talking about are the two combat cards. I think these are very important because combat cards apart from the actual Deadeye card are the ones that cause the biggest change around builds. Everything has an impact, but these are the ones that have the biggest impact. So let's take a look. One of them says the Eternal Flame, and this gives me the feeling that it's more towards, you know, fiery objects, whether it's fire arrows, fire bottles, but that's around what I believe. It could be that you do more damage, or that you take less damage from being in, you know, fiery situations. And the other one, I have no idea what it could possibly mean. It kind of shows a guy melting, so it could be damage over time, you know, drip damage. It could be that you do more damage with things like fire or toxic, which is damage over time, or even poison arrows, which would also be very interesting. Now, I think these are very, very nice, but the one that has me super interested is the one ability card that actually changes our Deadeye. A person of conviction. Now I have no idea what this is all about. It could be that the lady in the picture is looking crazy or that she's on fire. But if it is an ability card that has those type of effects, it would be very nice. Like I said, damage over time or even you know working with fire or toxic is very interesting. I've talked about how I think that those things should be added to the game. Damage over time, even with the naturals role before. So overall, very interesting leak. I don't tend to cover these type of videos very often. I have covered leaks and rumors before, but I don't do it. It's just that, you know, it's dry as hell right now, so we gotta talk about something. Nonetheless, I made sure the video was quick to the point. You got to see how the ability cards looked. That's pretty much it. If you wanna know what's going on on screen, make sure you check out my daily live streams for Red Dead Redemption. Subscribe to the channel, hit that notifications bell, check our Discord out, and I'll be catching you guys tonight. Your boy Death Gun, out.